start by introducing a little bit the history. As you all know, and we state on the session description on the website, the internet developed largely outside the realm of governments. Governments did not notice that there was something taking place, something revolutionary of utmost importance, and the internet took off. But then in the mid-90s, governments began to get a little bit interested. And 1998 was a key year. Uh, that was when the US government decided that they needed to have a more solid structure for dealing with the DNS, and they incorporated the Internet Corporation for assigned names and numbers. And the very same year, there were ministerial conferences of the WTO and of the OECD, and governments then, in their wisdom, decided uh, it was best not to do anything about the Internet, but let the technology grow and evolve, they feared that taking early decisions uh, on how the internet should be run on e-commerce might stifle the development of the technology. And in the very same year, the International Telecommunication Union had a plenipotentiary meeting in Minneapolis, and that meeting decided to hold a summit, a world summit, on the information society. And that brings us to the debate we had for the past 10 years. This year, 10 years ago, we were in this very building. Many of us in this room were participating in the first PrepCom for this World Summit on the Information Society. It was a long and protracted affair. There was a first summit in Geneva, adopted a declaration of principles which had some basic principles on internet governance and which introduced the notion of uh, all stakeholders should be involved in how the internet is being run. Also, as principles, uh, it introduced that it should be done in a transparent, inclusive and transparent manner. Between the two summits, there was a working group on internet governance that delved a little bit deeper with these issues and the findings of this working group. And looking around on this panel, two of the members are on this panel, so Raul Echeverria and Avri Doria were in this working group. And the second phase of the summit more or less endorsed the findings of this working group and validated the uh, internet model of bottom-up multi-stakeholder cooperation. Uh, there was in addition, a decision to create a platform for dialogue, the Internet Governance Forum. And there was a little bit of a yes, but. Yes, the current system works well, but we need to do more, and we need to start the process towards enhanced cooperation. And now the Internet Governance Forum has taken off, and the discussion on enhanced cooperation is still going around in circles as there are different interpretations by different stakeholders of what it means. The next session on enhanced cooperation will take place on 18th of May, also in Geneva, in the framework of the Commission of Science and Technology for Development.